the Heartstopper cast danced in front of homophobic protesters at London Pride. The cast of the heartwarming teen drama Heartstopper on Netflix recently attended London Pride. One video that went viral with over 11 million views, I'm sorry, 11 million shares, shows Joe Locke, who plays Charlie Spring on the show, and Sebastian Croft, who plays his first love interest, Ben Hope, dancing in front of anti-gay protesters. The two are bouncing up and down, flipping off the decidedly grumpy old men as another parade goer attempts to pull one of the anti-gay signs away. In a perfect bit of situational irony, they are dancing in front of the haters to Whitney Houston's I Want to Dance with Somebody Who Loves Me. Lovely. Uh, this Lovely. is so awesome. This is cathartic. You know, cathartic. my favorite kind of content is counter protesters for the Westboro Baptist Church. Yes. So this is right in line <laughs> yes. with that. Yes. And those idiots have obviously made it there as well. Yeah. I mean, ugh. And old, old white guys in suits with yeah. Bible verse signs. Yeah. Not just an American problem. Yeah. <laughs> That's absolutely true. Yeah, they always tell us to not deal with the protesters when they're out there, uh, you know, at our prides. Because they have their right to also protest and all of them. But some of them really do pass the mark and are very rude and bullying to people walking by. So, you know, a lot of these protesters deserve exactly what these guys uh, threw at them. Yeah. I just mean, anyone viral. You know what? Just just hand them one of those, like, one of those dick dick waffle waffle things that they had at Miami Beach Pride last time. And then I'm sure they'll be happy. They'll get over it and go home. You know, I have dick to... Dick waffles? I, yeah. <laughs> it's not what no, you think. Don, Don is like, I didn't uh, get any. Stop. Where do I order mine? Stop. Can I order you extra know. whipped cream with you it? Know. Stop. <laughs> Maple syrup. Uh, you know, um, I am I feel a little creepy to say I love Heartstopper. I, I, I binged it. Yeah. I have binged it a second time. Oh, if you wow. haven't watched Heartstopper, you really should. Because uh, you want to see Olivia Colman. Because she's uh, so great. Yeah, that's it. Um, and it's like Love, Simon, but completely different. Do you, are Simon. you sure you want us to binge it? Because the last time you wanted us to binge something, it got canceled. Yeah, so that's true. Oh, this, um, has been, this has been renewed. Yeah, it's been renewed. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, and it's, uh, it's a mammoth hit, British, uh, uh, you know, uh, young adult comedy. That's why I feel uh, creepy about it. Um, uh, but it is great, and you should watch Heartstoppers. The other thing that's wonderful about this is uh, we're so proud of London. Um, we're a million, all right? come on a million people came yeah. to that parade over the weekend and uh, um, <laughs> London was on its knees uh, pride in 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 Britain and London especially was even harder hit than it was yeah. in the United States and um, there was so many questions about it and they have just roared back and mm -hmm. so we're so happy to see this and and moments like this and and to your observation about protests I just I always point out in 2016 uh, when I was at the Stonewall Pride, uh, we, a, a huge uh, crowd, about a quarter of a million, not as big as London, um, and we were marching with Eddie Sotomayor's family and Pulse, all of the, all of the remembrance uh, placards. It was just three weeks after Pulse, and uh, we would hear Eddie's name chanted over and over again at different times in the parade, and it would start up and it would go, Eddie, Eddie, and we'd hear it, and it'd get louder and louder and louder, and it wasn't until about halfway through the parade that we realized that it was protest groups like that that had free speech zones and they were screaming the most horrible things about Pulse and the people that had uh. been murdered, uh, et cetera. Except none of the Alan Chuck, none of the Eddie Sotomayor family, none of the people who loved uh, him and, and uh, were so broken over Pulse could ever hear a single negative word. Because in that way, in that moment, Whitney Houston was singing, I just want to dance with somebody. And it got us right through it. Mm -hmm. So I understood that moment. I love that moment. Droning Thank out the you. haters. Drone out the haters. And a little occasional flipping off. That's not so bad. <laughs> LGBTQ plus news is vital for our community and for the broader world as a whole. We have enough enemies at Fox News. Tucker, Sean, and Lara are loud. We need passionate allies. Happening Out Television Network, Queer News Tonight, and It's Happening Out are literally out of the closet and into the headlines. Our community needs your support. 
like this broadcast, and subscribe now to ensure the growth of the entire LGBTQ plus community.